Beyond the current work, we must do more and do better in worker segments that NTUC has underserved. In the PME space, we have moved decisively with key proposals to level the playing field and improve HR practices. Minister for Manpower, Brother Tan Si Ling, has responded with the Compass and the Workplace Fairness legislation to level the playing field. And NTUC will support those endeavours and importantly, support the efforts to certify all 12,000 of HR practitioners to comply with these fair employment practices. NTUC will keep our ears close to the ground, especially this PME segment, so that we can continue to champion their interests and concerns in the way ahead. However, in the youth segment, NTUC recognises that we can do more to serve our youth better. And we will do so. One year ago, at May Day Rally, we launched the Youth Task Force to hear directly our youth's aspirations, needs and challenges. We have now engaged over 10,000 of our youths to hear directly from them. They have shared with us their key concerns, career prospects and opportunities, finances and mental well-being. And specific to careers, the youths desire quality internships and career mentorships to help them gain real work experience as they transit into the workforce. NTUC conceptualised a career trial where young NTUC can potentially bridge the gap, where youth can access quality jobs with workplace mentors alongside as they move into the workforce, where businesses can access a steady pipeline of young talents and where key stakeholders and NTUC can all come together to create the ecosystem and sustain this potential career trial. As a start, NTUC and SNEF will pilot a career starter lab comprising 100 companies to provide high-quality and structured career trials with mentorship to post IHL's use, including those finishing NS and seeking to enter the workforce.